Now, after we already get the data from the Firestore, we already have the products for the plants. So, what we are going to do now is to list out all the plants that we have inside the home page. So now we back to the home.js and under the paragraph we type object dot entries and then products and then we use the map functions to get the product ID and also the product data because inside the products object we have the product ID and also the product data so when you look at the product, you can see the product ID and also this product data. So what is object.entries? Object.entry is to get the key values pairs and into an array. So when you back to here and for example, under here we type console.load and then object.entries and then object.entries product and then we go to the web and now you can see there are array and inside the array, we have the array which have the product ID and also the product data. So now if we want to get the product ID and product data, we have to destructure. So to get the product ID and also the product data. So we create a div with class name plans and also we pass the key as the product ID. And then inside the div, we have the div and then we have the product data dot name and then we have the product data dot description and then after this div we have the button and then we have the subscribe and now when you go to here you can see the plan and also the subscribe buttons and if you want to display better we have to add some css so now we have to create a home.css inside the components folder and inside the home.css we are going to add the plans CSS. We are going to display flags, and then we use justify content space between, and then we have the margin left auto and margin right auto, and then we have mass width of 500 pixels. These two is to make sure the buttons or the list is in the center of the page, and space between is to push the plans and also the button to two sides and this control the maximum width of the list. So now what we forgot to do is we have to import the CSS at the home component. So we import the home.css and save. Now you can see the plans and also the subscription buttons are displayed side by side. 